Um, yeah, I thought it was a deserved win. I feel like we've been kind of chasing this first win now, obviously since well, second win since the start of the season. I feel like we've put in performances where we've had like lots of chances and just not really had that game where we've where we've scored enough goals. And I think tonight was the night where kind of that barrier opened. I think getting the goal in the first half helps a lot and gives us a bit of confidence. And then I always felt like even though we was under quite a bit of pressure that once we won the ball back, we had a chance on the break and I think the goals kind of sh uh, showed that. <clears throat> hey, Connor, thanks for the time tonight. Um, you know, recess for you, I guess, just what does it mean to have a performance like that? Um, but also, just what did you see on the, on the field that allowed you to make some of those plays? Because whatever you guys did have the ball, the ball felt like Galaxy set off at times, really let you guys operate. <laughs> Yeah, um, it's definitely a confidence booster to have a game like that. I felt like I feel like I've been building confidence throughout the season just from getting minutes under my belt and obviously playing, having a lot of playing time. But I feel like you need to kind of put the numbers up at some point and get some sort of goals and assists to kind of back yourself up really with, with the minutes that you're getting. So that's always nice to kind of have an influence on the game and play a part in the goals. And yeah, like you said, I, I felt like they had a lot of the ball, but I didn't really feel like we was in danger for a lot of the game. I felt like the back three were solid as always, and you know they did they do a job of defending the box. We try and push the ball out wide, and if they cross it, you know we're confident that Danny Maxwell and Lalas will kind of deal with that. And then, I thought in the first half when we won the ball back, it was a little bit sloppy, um, lost the ball too much. But I thought in the second half, you know when we kind of broke that first press when we won it back, we always looked like scoring and. Um, yeah, that showed the, the two goals in the second half were really good and really well worked. <clears throat> you, but, you know, last year, pretty clear with you, he was one of the best midfielders in this league and giving an absolute handful of the ball. Your thoughts on dealing with him and how you and Bell, you know, ultimately adjusted and kept him quiet tonight? I'm sorry, now we've got that. Yeah. Did that cut out? Oh, well, I'm sorry. Um, uh, dealing with Ricky Pooch. <coughs> Yeah, so we um obviously we do our analysis in the week um on who we're going to be playing against, and I think obviously when you play against Galaxy, his name's going to come up a lot with the the talent and the ability that he has, and you know I still think he definitely showed that tonight, and even though we limited him to kind of minimal like chances created, I felt like he had a lot of the ball and he showed kind of how good of a player that he is, but I think if we can kind of do what we did, keep bodies behind the ball, keep the gaps tight and not really give him anything. We're kind of happy for him to have the ball where he had it. And, you know, there's always going to be times when players with that kind of ability play a little one-twos around you and try and break them lines. But I thought um, I thought in general we dealt with them quite well and maybe got a little bit fatigued at the end for their for their goal. But that, that, um, that can happen when you're working as hard as we are. Yeah, I feel like we've we've kind of been speaking about that for a few weeks now, and it <clears throat> it's probably getting to sound a little bit repetitive, but um, it's nice that it's kind of finally happened, and we've kind of proven that that's the way we feel. And on the training pitch, we've been working really hard, and in the games, we have felt like it's just a matter of time before we do get that first big result. And you know, I think I think it's fair to say that this is it, and this is a real starting point for our season. Hopefully, we can kick on from this. <laughs> Yeah, Connor, you know, for, for Kevin's goal, a great counter attack and finish, but in the build up to tonight, did you notice anything different about him this past week in, in training, considering he was going up against his old club, or is, is it just, uh, I guess, you know, how he's been even keeled and was waiting for those moments? Yeah, I think, I think there's always going to be that little bit of, um, I wouldn't know what the word is, but when playing against your old team, you kind of want to prove yourself, if anything. And um, 
to be honest, I wouldn't say I've noticed anything particularly in training. He's a Kevin's a good professional and he, he trains like he does every single week. But I'd say maybe in the game today, you've seen a little bit more bite from him, um, pressing the ball, chasing lost causes and just that kind of relentless running. He gives us that different option when we're, when we're under pressure at times, when we win it back to kind of looking behind and the pace that he has, you know, that he can, he can chase things down. And yeah, he, uh, he deserved the goal that he got tonight, definitely. <coughs> Connor, Sam Nicholson's been settling into that left wing, left wing back role for the club. I know this was prior to your time with the, the club, but you know he was mostly on the right and a more of an attacking role. How have you seen him settle into that position, and how is he, you know, growing into that role? Yeah, I thought he played really well tonight. Um, I think it's always difficult to kind of transition to a new position, especially when you know a lot of preseason we played before at the back and. Obviously, we didn't start the season great and decided to kind of change that quite early on. And, you know, Sam kind of, you know, you could say he got through in at the deep end a little bit in there and you have to kind of adapt to that as quick as you can. And I think he's done that. I think, obviously, there's a lot more dis defensive responsibility in that, which uh, Sam's always willing to do. He's a hard worker and he'll, he'll always do what's asked of him. But <clears throat> it was good tonight how we kind of seen him get forward a little bit more and be in natural positions from a little bit more and you know hopefully as the season goes on and we start to pick up confidence in the system we can start to see him more in them positions <coughs> yeah just in this this streak of seven unbeaten now just how much confidence are you guys gaining as a team and how does it translate into better and better results yeah, I think I think this tonight will do us a lot of good. I know we've been speaking about the the unbeaten run for obviously the past few weeks, but um, we needed to get some wins in there. There's no, um, it's okay being unbeaten for five six games, but you'd rather be picking up three points every now and again as well. So I think, like I said earlier, tonight's hopefully going to be a, a bit of a starting point for us and just picking up that confidence and. I think the three goals tonight's probably the biggest thing. I think even the past game that we won, it's. We've we'll, struggled we'll to put the ball in the net, and yeah, hopefully we can just kick on and keep scoring and keep winning. Yeah, so that's been kind of a case of the dam breaking as well. I feel like not just probably set pieces in particular. Actually, I feel like that's where we've been at our most dangerous. Um, and yeah, we work we work really hard on them. Sharpie does a lot of work on them and not just offensively, but defensively. I think we feel really solid when teams have a lot of set pieces against us. And, you know, attacking, we kind of stopped really, <laughs> stopped kind of trying new things because what we was doing was working so well. It was just a matter of time before we actually got the goal. So um, again, hopefully tonight's kind of something to build on from that. And it gives kind of the big lads coming up from the back when we get the set pieces confidence that, you know, we are going to put the ball in the net when we get them chances. <laughs>